my channel if you're new. My name is Tasani and today I am back with another video. I am currently getting ready for church. It is 7.44. Jesus. Wow. Okay, it's 7.44 and I am about to do my skincare and then I just have to get dressed. So that's all I have to do. I just steamed my face and so I'm about to like... I see you do my skincare for the morning. Hey guys, so we are back from church. It was really, really good service. And then we came back, we ate because they were doing a no spend November, so no food out. Usually sometimes we go to like brunch, but we came back and we ate and now we are at my clubhouse, my apartment clubhouse, and I'm gonna edit. That is what we're doing. So I will talk to you guys later, after, but yeah. So I think a good amount of us know what the Pomodoro study method is, but if you don't know, the Pomodoro method is a simple time management technique that breaks your tasks into smaller, more manageable steps. So you could work for an hour and then take a 20 minute break, or you could do an hour and a half and rest for 30 minutes. Regardless of how you decide to split your time, this approach helps you stay productive while avoiding burnout. Navigating my 20s has felt a lot like using the Pomodoro method. It's about learning to balance my goals and dreams with the everyday demands of life. Whether it's work, studying, or just making time for family and friends, it's something that I really had to learn during this time period. Sometimes you really only have a little bit of energy to give, and honestly that's okay. The important thing is to take the breaks that you need and then get right back into it. Whether I'm studying, editing, or just trying to get through the day, Young adulthood is all about finding that sweet spot between working hard and pausing to recharge. It hasn't been easy, but it's been worth it to figure out how to create a nice balance. So as you guys work through your goals and your dreams, I'd love to challenge you guys to just try the Pomodoro Method and see if it works for you. I won that round, you guys. The last one I lost, but I won. I thought I was gonna lose. We race, we do word searches, and we race doing them. And that was what we did during our break time. I've been editing for two hours, by the way. So after the first hour, I didn't take a break, and then I just started editing again, and then I just took a break. Like 10-ish minutes, probably 15 minutes. Yes, I'm gonna get back into it. <laughs> Just spent the 
about 20 up in Neiman Did 200 in the Demon I'm the illest and I mean it My homie dropping bodies for no reason When I was kids, see him on the weekends Got the bacon soda for the remix We get in so I'm not gonna see it Cause my heart is full of love No weapon formed against me Cause I'm covered in the blood Laying in the hospital when I got shot, fam Mama prayed for me, said she left it in God's hands Yeah, so I'ma leave it in God's hands Everything I'm doing now is God's plan Doctor said I wouldn't walk no more Now I stand, then I ran Here I am, ashamed The fast cools with the fast food, bad hat tools and a bad food. If you don't turn to a little goddy, they gon' train all the scrap in your little body. They turn me into a little goddy. Uh, yeah. Now Wakanda, but Wakanda is kinda like what we about to make. And who gon' make it? Conda. Who the squad? Donda. Um, I haven't recorded since Sunday and it's. Friday. As you can see, I took my hair out because my scalp was itching. Like, oh my gosh, like it was itching. The wraparound at the ponytail was coming up. My hair kept getting frizzy and I was tired of putting like more like spray on it. So I was just like, let me just let me just take it out. We are going to do our hair. And originally I wanted to get a sew-in, but I'm not spending any money right now and the sewing would have been four hundred dollars. $400 that I don't have. So we're going to do our hair at home. I saw this girl on TikTok do these boneless braids. So I was like, okay, period. Like, I'm going to do that. Like, So I bought these gloves because I'm going to wear them when I'm washing my hair. Only reason I'm doing that is because my nails are like, like it's like breaking a little bit. And so I just know it's going to be too, I don't feel like having to deal with that. And then I bought a uh, wide tooth comb. And I bought this. They said it's a shampoo cup. I've been using Carol's Daughter Goddess Strength Shampoo and Conditioner. The shampoo's good. Um, it's a cleansing shampoo, but the conditioner, I feel like it just, it's, I don't know, it's just not the best for, for my hair when it comes to detangling. Like, I feel like I've had better conditioners than my, it just slips, and so I really don't like it. So, I saw this on TikTok. It's the Design Essentials Honey Cream Moisture Retention Super Detangling Conditioning Shampoo. Um, to help because my hair is dry with the um with the dye like it is dry now okay and then I bought this conditioner it is design essentials rosemary and mint sulfate free stimulating super moisturizing conditioner so and then I bought this mask um, I was walking around walking around trying to find a deep conditioner and they were all like twenty dollars so I said you know what I've used this before and it works pretty darn good everything else that i'm using is conditioning anyway i'm just gonna you need something quick and simple and cheap to leave in for 15 minutes i need to dry it real quick and do what it do then i bought some shining jam obviously i bought a new bonnet because i have one that the bow you guys have seen it um and i'm sometimes i'm just tired of the bow like it'd be flopping in my face so i bought that so i'm braiding here i only bought one pack i'm really not trying to do that much when it comes to braiding <laughs> i'm trying to do you know quick little and put it in so we're gonna see if one pack gets me where i need it to get me hopefully it does i'm already planning on this taking like a couple of days that's everything that i got from the beauty supply store i'm about to get in the shower and yeah okay guys so i really haven't showed you guys much of this process so sorry but i have this side done and then this side but i think after i finish my whole head i'm gonna redo this side because the parts are like really big and i realized after i was done that mm, it's gonna look a little weird if like the parts are like big or like medium sized parts have to be done with this front section by 12 o'clock it's 10 54 i think 10 55 ish 
So I think I'll be done by 12. I'm going to my nephew's birthday party and it starts at 1, I'm pretty sure. So we at least need to be leaving here by like 12.30. And then I'll finish the bag. I'll do some kind of like bun or something and then put a headband on like and just call it a day. I've only used one and I still have enough. But Donda, who can see Donda, get Don's feet. Who needs practice? I don't do rehearsals and I don't do commercials. Cause they too commercial. Give it all to God and let Jesus reimburse you. She said you in the studio with who? I'm gonna hurt you. How I'm 42, gotta curve you. How I'm nervous they tell you how they gon' curve you. Quiet all the chords in this. We walk in God's spiritual ordinance. We know the blacks of orphans refuse to be runaways. Rebel, renegade, must stay paid. You can take it all with the Lord on my side. The won't die. Hey guys, I'm back home now. It's seven o'clock. Took the whole back of my head, but it's okay. I went to my nephew's birthday party at the skate ring after we went to Michael's, which you guys saw, and then we did go to Target also, but I forgot my camera in the car. Like, what the freak? So you guys didn't get to see it in Target, but they actually had their like sale. I was going to get my Christmas tree on Amazon and it was like a hundred dollars, it was 109 for a seven and a half foot tree. And then when we went to Michael's, I saw that they also had a seven and a half foot tree for 117. Then we went to Target and they had trees and they were on sale. I saw that it, the sale ended today on the 9th. So I said, oh no, we're getting that today. It's the cheapest set. It's the cheapest. So I got a seven foot tree and it was, it was actually originally at $85 and on sale it was 59 This will be my first year decorating in any of my apartments. So I'm super duper excited. I'll show you guys what I got from Michael's. Oh, what you guys saw is doing this, but they had a sale and it was three for $9. So we got warm apple cider. We got butterscotch brulee. We also got midnight forest. And then from Target, I got these cute Christmas kitchen towels. We got a couple of ornaments because we figured like the single ones, like if we don't get them now, they're definitely gonna be gone. Well, the next time. So we got an angel, this bell ornament, and it's red. So it's so cute. Got this cute picture ornament. And then we got these cute cups. We were meant to be. <laughs> They're so freaking cute. They're so adorable. That's everything that we got. Um, we're hungry, so we're gonna eat. And then also, I need to finish my hair. Um, but I'm like kind of not in a rush to do that. So I might be doing that for a couple days and I need to wash clothes. So that's what we're doing. Um, and I'll talk to you guys. Is it this is so I don't say stop it. And it's Yeah, slash the word just.